We look around us and we know, we know that there's something wrong because your neighbour next door is a nice person, your family are, are nice, people you work with are nice. People want to have a nice society where we can live in peace and just live and be free of wars. So you think, well, where's it coming from? What's the origin of it? The Catholic Church, the Roman cult, has been very, very, very busy in the last couple of thousand years. This empire is our enemy. Uh, with the backing of the Roman cult and a very, very dark priesthood. What the Catholic Church did in 1302, Pope Boniface VIII, Bon means good, Fage means to do in Latin, do gooder. This guy and the Catholic Church always desiring to control, control, control with their inquisitions, decided that they would create the first express trust in history. All right, that trust is called Unum Sanctum. What does the papal bull say? It says that all the world and all the souls in it are ours. They made a claim of right. They rocked up, sitting on top of the world, look around, seeing all these people sleeping, got all these got gold in their vaults and all this power, and they said, we own the world. And so they do, because no one has challenged that. No one has challenged Unum Sanctum, this papal bull. It's in the vaults, and it's a curse on mankind, and I'll show you how. This was the first express trust in history, so they have claimed the whole world and all the souls therein. They have registered you. Claim your dominion as children of God, of the universe, and not as their slaves, as people lost at sea, incompetent, with no soul, because they own it. They're insane. The elite families who control the Vatican and who, who are behind this corporation Monotheism, military, money, monarchies, actually sit on top, behind the scenes, but they work together. Families of the world who think they have better blood than the rest, and they have their think tanks, then they have their financial control system, world resource control, world population control, and there's a little sheet down the bottom called debt slaves. We're all debted, and you get taxed. Half of it goes to the government. You know those titles you have? You don't own it, you own nothing. You do not own a thing, well you can't anyway. They're molecules. They belong to the universe for a start, but you can have right of use. That's all that that title means. You will never own it, never in this system, in this system, I mean, which is about 20. This is their fictional kingdom that they created. Remember Shrek and the king and his fictional characters? Same deal.